I'm here to react to Uptension's new music video, uh, Catch Me. And I had no idea that's the title. I don't know, maybe I didn't read the teaser's title. I was just like, oh, teaser! Uh, so I already pre ordered the album, of course. And this is their second mini album, which is exciting. I guess they just don't wanna like be behind the 17 Amon Stacks because they both had two minis this year. So I guess that's what Top Media is doing. So. And Juani is my bias, he has been since uh, their pre-debut show, so yeah, and he's not like Beckham, so like stop. <laughs> and, oh, it's exciting, I love all of them, so let's start. Uh, mm -hmm. Loading, why is this loading? Is this planning to sort? Oh, okay. Cool, hey! So, kitchen. Honey! <laughs> Cookie and chow. Shushin. Sanyol. Bito has blue hair. Hello, Shin. I like him starting the songs. Oh, Kakia! <laughs> oh. Oh. Kun rapping. And way. It's precious with pink hair. All this way and cool. What? Oh, Gino! Oh, oh cute Jin. Always, I need more kitchen. I love that set. Like so many colors, I love everything. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> love every color. What's the shadow? Basically, now Kun is a rapper. I mean, now it's Bito, obviously, but. Still trying to figure out what the MV is about. <laughs> oh, that hat! <gasps> so much coon! Not complaining. Oh, so you have a line there. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. I really have no idea. So much way. Oh, honey's voice. Oh, he's such a talented baby boy. And the kitchen in the middle. Please, more of that. I love his dancing. That part with the way. That's an interesting line distribution. Oh. <laughs> okay, I have no idea what the envy was about. But it was pretty and, and fun and colorful. That's an interesting line distribution, like there was a lot of Wei and Kun. 
Well, his voice, they didn't show Kun as much, but that can only be him. And one part, I was not sure whose vocals were those. But it's probably someone who they didn't show have lines. Huh, I don't know, but this was around the first half or something, like something, somewhere around that. Yeah, and like, Wuxing got a lot of screen time, but I think he got less lines than he did in... Well, it's not like they have many lines because there's 10 of them, so... I just feel like they really gave more uh, opportunities to Kun and Wei, and I really appreciate that, because um, I feel like them and Kyujin got less uh, from So Dangerous, so... That's really nice. About their looks, because like at first listen, I can't really say much about the song. I quite like it. I think So Dangerous is much easier to like at first listen. It's like, la, 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 la. okay, I didn't know what to say about it yet. There's a lot of rap kind of parts, so we'll see. I need a couple more listens to have a better opinion, a more useful opinion on the song. So for the looks, uh, Jinu and his hat, like that's like I remember, but he has a dark hair and in the, and in the beginning I accidentally called him a Bito for like why? I have no idea because Bito has blue hair, so like, but uh, Jinu looks nice. I don't know if I prefer the blonde on him or not. He looks good in both. Then um, Kun, it's like grey hair. Uh, I liked the blonde one better, but Kyun is still handsome, so... <laughs> then Gokyo looks amazing, and I feel like I didn't get enough Gokyo, and the end was so funny, and like, Wushin, uh, I don't know what he does to them, but like, he was the only one, Gokyo, who didn't fall, so that was like, what? <laughs> and then even his face, he wasn't as, uh, like, surprised, or what faces they were making, as the rest, so he just made a different face. Um, so then Wei, oh, he's precious, <laughs> uh, he looks nice with this uh, hairstyle and and everything, and then, like, Bito and Wuxin, I never know which of them is older, I have no idea why, I think Bito is older, but yeah, he looks really, really nice with blue hair, really like, but like, I really like blue, so I'm just biased towards the color, but he did look nice, and uh, he got nice amount of parts and so like, that was nice. Wushin, he looks nice with this red hair, but like it's red for him for a while. Um, he looks pretty, he, he's really pretty. Wushin is pretty, but we all know that. <laughs> um, then, who's next? Um, Son Yul. Oh, he's so precious blonde. He did, didn't show him in, enough. I felt like I didn't get enough Son Yul. And like, I, I only remember once showing him while he had lines, but obviously because it's so new, he must have had a lot of lines, it's just like, um, not when they were showing him. But because there's a lot of storyline, which I still didn't understand. And then the next one is Kyujin, he's always precious, and I'm glad he got that choreography part in the middle, and he also got line... I'm not sure if it's lines, <laughs> like he didn't get many, uh, or maybe he was the one who I just didn't know who sung that part, but it's only one listen, and then Honey, not gonna talk about the perfect baby, like he's such a baby, <laughs> like he's a real baby, <laughs> um, like he looks nice of course, and he sings nice of course, like he's funny, and Xiao, I felt like he had less parts than in So Dangerous, but he has pink hair, so everyone's going to notice him. Like, Chao looks adorable with his uh, candy floss hair. Yeah, I would say that because like he is like that. Oh, Chao, Chao. Did I say Chao? I wanted to say Chao. Okay, so I think I'm going to because like I talked too much at the end. Um, all in all, everyone looks great. The song sounds promising, um, and the MV was lovely like it was really pretty so I really like that so I'm going to rewatch that and focus on even more things because, yes and yes <laughs> bye